Hello and welcome back to another episode of Achievement Master, a show in which I will tell you all about some of the achievements in certain games and how to get them, so that you too can be an Achievement Master. Today we are going to look at the achievement A Solid B. This achievement is not particularly difficult, but very much time consuming. To get this achievement you have to get every single title of every of the 6 characters to a 2 star level. This may already be quite confusing, as the star level is nowhere displayed, outside of the end of combat screen. You can however determine what level a title is by looking at how many skills you have unlocked for that title. A title is 1 star if you only have 2 skills, 2 star if you have 3 skills and 3 star if you have all 4 available to you. Now we need only 2 stars on every title, so in order to get this achievement, look at all your titles that don't have 3 skills unlocked yet. Now there are a lot of titles and I'm not going to show you how to get every single 1 to 5 stars, as a lot of them can and will easily be acquired simply by playing the game. Instead I'm going to show you the 5 titles that are the most difficult to get to 2 stars and what is the easiest way to grind them. Now the first 2 of the titles already are kind of similar, so I'm going to mention both here because those are the titles for using martial arts, hidden arts or malak arts respectively. Every character has two forms of attack. Velvet and Rokro have martial arts and hidden arts, Eleanor and Aizen have martial arts and malak arts and Magilu and Lafacet have hidden and malak arts. To get a 2 star ranking you have to use the respective art type 2500 times on that character. Now this may sound like a lot, however it's much easier than it looks when you figure out that the AI controlled characters can do that for you. If you need for example Lafacet to use 2500 hidden arts which are his paper based attacks, we can simply go into the arts menu and disable all of his mala arts. In addition, we should also change his tactic in the strategy menu to close combat, as all of his hidden arts are close combat attacks. So now we only need to keep these settings until Lafacet earns his title, while we can now try and work on other titles, or simply complete the game. Just be sure to re-enable his arts again and change his strategy back to engage at distance once you're done, so that Lafacet actually pulls his weight. Now the third toughest title is a true insert character here, title for every character. You get this title to 2 stars by controlling the character in question at the end of battle for a whooping 150 fights. If you have been playing nothing but a single character, probably Velvet, throughout the entire game, you will now have to do about 750 fights just for this title. A good move here would have been to simply not only play Velvet while you progress throughout the story or even while playing the post game content as you will then at least make a good amount of progress towards these titles. However, chances are you already played through most of the game. An easy way to grind for these titles is to turn down the difficulty to simple and then simply go to a fairly crowded area like the Danan Highway and one shot the enemies about 750 times. Of course, this still takes quite a long time, which is why I'd recommend to only do that if you have already done all of the other titles and you're missing some of the times play titles. The second toughest titles to get to 2 stars are probably the Mystic Art titles. You are required to have every character use 250 Mystic Arts to get these titles. Now of course you won't start this counter at 0 as the AI uses Mystic Arts on their own. However there is no way to force them into Mystic Arts unlike with the Arts usage titles. I found the fastest way to do this is to play the character you want to get the progress on, then go to the Elite Quarter Island. You can do this on any difficulty that you like, but of course this works the best on Chaos difficulty as the enemies live longer. Simply hit the enemy once, then execute a mystic art immediately. Then use an arcane bottle to replenish two blast gauge so they don't run out. And throw in some brick swords to get a bit of extra blast gauge and to get rid of some souls. Keep doing this until you run out of arcane bottles. The good thing here is that the elite quarter gives you a decent amount of money and you can use that money to buy more arcane bottles in any late game shop like Port Zexon or Cat's Corner. And last but certainly not least we have the smashing titles. These require you to defeat 2500 enemies with each character to get them to 2 stars. 2500 enemies is a lot, especially since it only counts for the person that does the killing blow. As a result you'd need 15,000 enemies in total at least. You probably have to kill more as you'd be required to spread the kills perfectly among your characters. However, there is actually a fairly decent way of farming these titles. 
For this you just need to go to any demon quarter island. I use the aberrant quarter in this case since the enemies have the lowest level there. Then put the difficulty on simple and one shot your way through the enemy waves. The Baron Quarter will spawn 50 demons in total and takes about 1 minute to complete if you are high level and well equipped to one shot everything. So that makes 50 minutes and 50 clears per character in theory. Disregarding any killing blows your characters already did. Important here is that you don't waste your killing blows on characters that already have 2500 killing blows. If any of your characters already have the title on 2 stars then don't take them into your party and should that already be the case with more than 2 of your characters, take them with you into battle but put your strategy on defense only. That way they will only defend and heal and not steal any killing blows. You should try to spread the kills somewhat evenly though as of course the less party members are fighting actively the longer it'll take you to take out 50 enemies. Also know that it is easily possible to farm for the times control titles while doing this but most likely impossible to farm mystic arts uses as enemies die in one hit and you won't be able to use a mystic art on them. Those were the 5 titles that probably take the longest to get to 2 stars. There are of course more titles than these but most of them are easy to get to 2 stars. If you got all the titles to 2 stars you will be awarded with the A Solid B achievement. As always if you have any further questions with these achievements go ahead and ask them in the comments below. I'll be sure to answer them to the best of my ability. I hope this video helped you on your way to become an achievement master and if it did feel free to leave a like and or subscribe for more guides and other contents in the future. As always take care and I'll see you in the next one.